Okay, so I'm going to be demonstrating my uh, Alexa app, and um, not really much of an app, it's just uh, basically a pass-through that runs to my AMX control system, uh, which then handles all the communications back and forth to the uh, Alexa server, um, and also does all the control of the home. Um, it could easily be a Crestron device as well. It doesn't really matter if it's AMX, Crestron, Control 4, whatever you're using, but um, it's actually pretty easy to do. I plan to eventually put this on the on my web page somewhere where you can get the instructions on how to do it. But um, here's an example. So this is the uh, so my thermostat. It's an AMX thermostat. Um, and we're going to control it through Alexa. So Alexa, tell Max that I'm cold. Max has raised the set point by two degrees. The thermostat is currently set to 73. Alexa, tell Max that I'm hot. Max has lowered the set point by two degrees. The thermostat is currently set to 71. Not to sleep there, but there we go, back at 71. It's got it set up to control the television, so. Um, which runs through a video switcher down in the basement. Um, but we can go, uh, see, Alexa, tell Max to show me the security cameras. Max has switched the TV to the security cameras. And so then we can um, switch it back to the TV. We can say, uh, Alexa, tell Max to change the channel to ABC. Max has tuned the TV to ABC. And so it switches back to the um, my uh, HD tuner input and then changes the channel. And we could do the same thing, but we can just change the channel. We could say, uh, Alexa, tell Max to change the channel to NBC. Max has tuned the TV to NBC. And so another uh, cool thing you can do is actually have a conversation uh, back and forth if you don't close the connection um, and that's handy for doing stuff like volume control so you can say Alexa tell Max to raise the volume how is that louder how is that that's good great so there we uh, did multiple commands in the same string and um, when we ended the command by saying that that's good. Uh -oh. So we can uh, turn this off. See, Alexa, tell Max to turn the TV off. I'm not quite sure how to help you with that. No, nope. she missed that command. Alexa, tell Max to turn the TV off. Max has turned the TV off. And we can um, run some diagnostics too, um, if we wanted to and just issue multiple commands or maybe come back with a bunch of information about the house. We can do that by saying, Alexa, tell Max to run diagnostics. Security system disarmed. First floor temperature, 71 degrees. Humidity, 28%. Lower level temperature, 62 degrees. Humidity, 36%. And then if you have lighting control tied in, you can obviously control that too. So um, these are the wash lights on the fireplace. So say, Alexa, tell Max to turn the fireplace lights on. Whoop, missed that. Alexa, tell Max to turn the fireplace lights on. Sorry, I couldn't find a device or group named fireplace lights in John's profile. And sometimes it gets picked up by the native command, which if you're not clear when you do the wake word, it happens, but let's try it again. Alexa, tell Max to turn the fireplace lights on. Max has set the lighting level. And we can also go to a certain percentage. So we can say, Alexa, tell Max to turn the fireplace lights to 80%. Max has set the lighting level. Alexa, Tell Max to turn the fireplace lights off. Max has set the lighting level. And there we go off. So there's a bunch of different controls you can do with the Echo. Um, 
I mean, you can basically do anything you want since it's tied into the AMX system. So, um, you know, the possibilities are endless. It's all just a matter of invoking the keyword, whichever you set up um, in your Alexa skills. So, again, I'll detail that on the website when I get some time, but um, that's it. Amazon Echo, pretty cool.